Hi guys, my name is Bill, and what I want to do is a little follow-up video on one that I made on how to check your smooth top burner elements along with the switches. I just want to give you a little bit closer look at an element and how it works. Alright, so here's a real close look at the element itself. Now the contacts on the on the end of the burner here, this is going to be your 1A and this is going to be your 2A. These are your H1 and your H2 wires that come off your burner switch. Go to these contacts. The first contact right here goes right through. It starts on the windings, goes all the way around, comes back out right here, into here, and to the main limiter that I was talking about where you have two of them on your burner. This one here is going to control maximum temperature of the burner so it doesn't get too hot and that's just right here it gets too hot this contact breaks open now your H1 power can't get around to the H2 or your 1A and your 2A that's 240 volts to heat that up and this little limiter over here basically this is the B side, so you have 1B, 2B, basically you have 120 volts here. And then as this burner starts to warm up just a little bit to where you wouldn't be able to put your hand on the glass without burning yourself, this little contact will open up and create a circuit from here straight through to here and go down to your hot surface indicator light. That's basically how one of those works. Okay, so what I'm going to do right here is this is the hot surface indicator contact. Now, I'm going to turn my heat gun on and heat up this temperature probe. And we're going to watch this contact jump over to create the completed circuit from 2B through to 1B. And that will essentially light up the hot surface indicator light. So I'm going to turn the heat gun on. It's going to be loud. All right, and there it was. It clicked over, just real quick. Now the hot surface indicator light would be on. Now I'm not exactly sure how long that's gonna to take to cool back down, but we're not gonna sit here and watch it, but you'll get the idea. That'll snap back down, the light will go out. Oh, there it was. All right, so there you have it. That's how the limiter, now the other one's gonna work. Now I've already heated this up with my heat gun, and I couldn't get it to, to trip over, so. I'd imagine it will at, at a temperature higher than what my cheap heat gun is capable of doing. So there you have it, just a little, a little view of how one of those works. Alright guys, so that's it. That's how a smooth top burner element works. A little bit closer look. So I want to thank you guys for watching, and if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section. And be sure to subscribe to my channel for more helpful repair videos.